हेलो एवरी वन आई एम दत्तात्रेय निकम वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन अवर चैनल ई फंडा फॉर न्यू डे न्यू टॉपिक एंड अवर टूडे टॉपिक इज इंडस्ट्रियल कंट्रोल सिस्टम आई सी एस पार्ट ट्वेंटी थ्री एंड दिस टॉपिक विल बी प्रेजेंटेड इन पार्ट सो एज टू कवर द एंटायर सीरीज ऑन इंडस्ट्रियल कंट्रोल सिस्टम एंड इफ यू आर न्यू टू अवर चैनल देन प्लीज विजिट टू अवर चैनल ई फंडा एंड वॉच ऑल द वीडियोज क्रिएटेड रेलवे टॉपिक्स ऑफ इंजीनियरिंग fundamentals project and career instrumentation and engineering deliverables telecommunication engineering procurement engineering and renewable energy and special series of instrumentation interview question and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to get the latest notification on upload of our new video on our channel e funda so let's begin with our today's topic that is industrial control system ics part 23 introduction to industrial control system ics industrial control system is a collective term used to describe different types of a control system and associated instrumentation which includes the devices systems network and control used to operate and automate industrial processes depending upon the industry each ics functions differently and are built to electronically manage task efficiently today the devices and a protocol using an ics are used in nearly every industrial sector and critical infrastructure such as the manufacturing transportation energy and water treatment industries also there are several types of ics the most common of which are supervisory control and data acquisition that is the scada systems and distributed control systems are the major one local operations are often controlled by so called field devices that receives supervisory command from remote stations and here the different types of industrial control systems are distributed control system industrial automation and a control system that is iacs human machine interface that is hmi intelligent electronic devices that is ied programmable automatic controller that is a pac programmable logic controller that is a plc remote terminal unit that is rtu and various others types of control system here basically we will see the brief about the types of a control system one can refer to the picture where control systems are shown plc that is a programmable logic controller local controller stand alone pid controller that is a single loop controller rtu a remote terminal unit distributed control system that is a dcl safety plc that is a safety instrumented system or a emergency shutdown system that is esd fgs acs vms tgs that is a fire and gas system access control system vibration monitoring system tank gauging system etc are the various types of a control system used in industrial atmosphere where one can have efficient and controlled action overview of a various types of a control system first one is a plc that is a programmable logic controller one can refer to the picture to get a feel of how the plc system look like which consists of single processor typically multiple plcs can be network together multiple communication options fast processing high reliability often used as a emergency shutdown system small to medium system where few ios to thousands of ios can be scattered second is the distributed control system that is a dcs one can refer to the picture where one can see the architecture which includes mainly multiple processor architecture multiple communication options lower system reliability but high local reliability medium to large system that is a 500 ios to many thousands of ios which includes integrated hmi functionality rtu 
remote terminal unit one can refer to the picture where one can see the structure of a rtu unit which consists of single processor typically multiple rtus can be networked together multiple communications options fast processing high reliability small to medium system that is a few ios to 500 ios like plc but designed for remote installation low power consumptions where high environmental factors are included next system is the scada system supervisory control and data acquisition one can refer to the picture one can see the setup how the systems are being architecture and various types of uh, multiple communication as well as monitoring options are provided which provides main human machine interface that, that is hmi functionality which includes mainly graphics alarming and mainly report generation also provides interconnectivity to the business system the database driven and the scada systems can be provided for the plc systems rtu systems dcs systems or a combination of a system hmi human machine interface one can refer to the screen where one can see how the interface is being taken care into the graphics or a screen where various multiple equipments are shown with a connecting piping and instrument which mainly includes often called as a operator interface provides a user friendly interface for operators to quickly and easily understand the status of the entire plant pnl like symbols are being used colors are used to show the status of a various equipment and instrument during the operation animation is used to show movement and the changes also alarm text windows are used for detailing and this is how the ics that is industrial control systems are being classified and their briefs we have seen for continuation please watch this video series so as to have a better understanding on industrial control system that is ics in detail and the next parts will cover individual system design considerations and their as aspects while doing control system engineering with this we are concluding on our today's topic and you can find our channel details as follows if you are new to our channel that is our youtube channel e funda then subscribe to our channel e funda and don't forget to press bell icon to get latest notification of upload of our new video on our channel e funda similarly you can follow us on instagram page similarly you can follow us on our facebook page as well and keep watching our channel e funda for various topic related to engineering and a project with this we can assure you this will help you to better your understanding on engineering and a project topic keep watching our channel e funda thanks watch our channel for new day new topic